A new Lansing Police Initiative is putting more police on city streets this summer. It's a time when more home break-ins are usually common. Josh Sidorowitz talked with some neighborhood watch groups who say the crackdown should help the community policing. We started this uh, neighborhood watch uh, progressively about maybe two years ago. Chance Boyd recalling the high number of break-ins in his area on Lansing's west side at the time, among other crimes, ultimately driving his neighbors to come together. And we said enough is enough, and we decided that we were going to reclaim our neighborhood. The number of break-ins since is way down, just one this year. And while his neighborhood, like many, he says, still has its challenges, Friday's announcement from LPD, exactly what's needed to keep the momentum of progress swinging in their favor. I have faith in uh, LPD, at least uh, for what they have demonstrated uh, with us in this area for the last couple of years, and I strongly support them. In the Genesee neighborhood, where three Sexton High School students were shot this past September. Nothing like that had ever happened before and has not happened since. Neighbors there want to keep it that way. This new initiative is key in that effort for the neighborhood's Crime and Safety Committee. I certainly feel that it is uh, a good plan, a wise plan. Especially the part that will have officers working shorter shifts and putting more of them instead out on the streets during peak hours for crime. People who commit crimes don't work on a regular predictable schedule. So if they can allocate their resources to the areas where they know from experience are problem areas, that's going to be a more effective use of, of their resources. So I think, it's a, I think it's a fantastic idea. And that was Josh Adorowitz reporting. In the Morris Park neighborhood where we reported last fall, a string of break-ins had people living in fear. Now the director of the watch program says he's encouraged to see the new initiative taking a more proactive rather than reactive approach to dealing with that crime.